Well, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, uh, wherever you are in the world. Welcome to Onug 2020 uh, and day one and the Broadcom session on our proof of concept for AI-driven real-time identification and remediation of network congestion, packet loss, and latency. My name is Jeremy Rossback. I'm the Director of Product Marketing for the DX NetOps Network Monitoring Solution. And if you missed it, earlier today, our open session on next generation network telemetry powered by Silicon for automated triage and reliable application delivery was presented. So if you missed it, please check it out on demand. Uh, it talks about a lot of the capabilities that we can do inside of our DX NetOps network monitoring solution that are driven by our industry leading silicon and telemetry capabilities. So why don't we get started and talk about those capabilities. So first of all, um, uh, you know, Broadcom understands that uh, enterprises and service providers out, the day, out there today are continuing to struggle with uh, networking, increasing networking capex and opex, as well as, as crippling application uh, degradation issues that result from uh, maybe network congestion, packet loss, etc. So to overcome these challenges, uh, we're pleased to deliver an industry-first software to silicon solution. Uh, with our high-scale operations monitoring across fault performance and flow for traditional and software-defined spaces. Um, and now with industry-leading network monitoring data that's captured at the silicon level, uh, we deliver this one-of-a-kind real-time triage and visibility for network operations teams. And how do we do it? How are we helping to reduce uh, root cause analysis um, for these application impacting uh, events? Um, we can do it from, from hours to days down to minutes. And this is what the reality looks like today. Um, you wait for users to complain or you wait for your network monitoring solution to poll and then alert you. You may have many tools you use to investigate uh, maybe it's packet sniffers, log analysis, etc. cetera. Uh, you have many codes to investigate. A lot of packet loss comes with a lot of different uh, reasons for, for that happening in the network, what, identifying which reason is for the packet loss, um, which applications are impacted by this degradation, which users are impacted by this degradation, what systems are impacted, and finally, what's changed, what happened? Prior to this outage, uh, did somebody fat finger a configuration, set a wrong route, etc.? The Broadcom reality uh, brings this down to mere minutes or seconds. So we provide real time visibility from uh, our industry leading si silicon and real time telemetry capabilities to improve your mean time to investigation with one single tool and single click access into user impact, utilization. Uh, the application impact, uh, and finally, automated triage steps to help restore the application experience. Maybe rolling back a config to a known good uh, state is one example of, of automation that we provide in, in these types of network operations, triage, uh, troubleshooting scenarios that go on every day inside of your organization. And here's, uh, here's the three examples of how we are helping to improve uh, network operations and their troubleshooting scenarios when it comes to degraded application experiences. And we're gonna get into these inside the demo. Um, network congestion triage, uh, again, powered by our silicon and telemetry for real-time alarm information across inventory, performance, fault, and flow. Within context, one-click uh, insights into uh, switch utilization, health, discards, errors, and then finally monitoring BST or buffer statistics tracking. Uh, we'll get into that more inside the demo for that real-time visibility into buffer utilization, resource monitoring, uh, queue monitoring, queue utilization, etc. Uh, these memory spaces that are holding these packets for delivery, monitoring that for continued allocation tuning of your network. Next, uh, real-time visibility into packet loss uh, for when packet drops occur, 
um, again, powered by our silicon and, and real-time telemetry capabilities to help you understand when packet loss is occurring in the network immediately. So you can triage it immediately with detailed explanations within the alarm that we present to network operations for that single tool access, breaking down um, all those tool sets that you have to, that you need to investigate with, like packet sniffers and log analysis. We provide all of that in a single tool for operations to understand the cause and, eff and effect. Uh, simple insights into the user impact, application impact with source, destination, port, protocol, etc. And then finally, uh, single-click access to device configuration with change analytics. What did the change look like before and afterwards with real-time auto automation, again, to roll back to a known good state. Um, again, helping to reduce root cause na analysis from hours or days down to minutes. And then finally, our AI ops solution uh, with, with uh, industry-leading service analytics, anomaly detection, alarm noise reduction, capacity analytics, predictive insights. Um, this uh, helps from an AI and ML standpoint across apps, infrastructure, networks, and the user experience to help with network latency at a service level, to help you understand how the network is performing um, and how it is impacting uh, your critical business services. Uh, this could be top flow analysis, this could be microburst analysis and queue congestion analysis, and of course, um, topology visualization for hop by hop flow analysis. And we'll get into that into the, in, in the demo as well. And then speaking of that, why don't we move into the demo to demonstrate those three different scenarios and these use cases for real-time network triage. All right, so this is our demonstration of uh, real-time network congestion triage. So our integration with our uh, Broadcom Silicon and Telemetry enables our DX NetOps network monitoring solution to monitor in real-time buffer statistics tracking, or BST utilization. This allows users to get real-time alerts on network congestion and detect microbursts within your switch fabric in your data centers. And BST is a feature that enables tracking the usage of switch buffers. It's switch buffer is a memory space set aside for storing packets awaiting transmission over networks or storing packets received. And think of it like a toll plaza. The more traffic there is, the longer the wait time to pay for your toll and get you on your way to your destination. So if buffers are congested, then wait times are longer to send packets over the network and the application experience is degraded. So you can imagine how the value of having these real-time insights in the network congestion to improve your triage and troubleshooting uh, steps. So first, we, we're looking at our alarm console here. We have a number of alarms here indicating a problem. And when we select one of these alarms, we get detailed information immediately. These details are generated directly from the switch and uh, from the silicon itself embedded. And we're getting congestion notifications directly from this device um, on individual buffers. So this isn't a five minute poll, but in it's real time quick insights into network congestion within seconds. It's an early warning system into a degraded application experience. And of course, we're improving your root cause analysis very, very quick. So DX NetOps provides one click access to everything you need to know about this device. Here we have our context pages and we have great SLA information like availability. Then we move into system health and gives us utilization from a CPU memory and interface perspective, along with trending and events, as well as heat charts that help identify hotspots in your network where you have traffic issues that need to be addressed. Then we can drill into specific interfaces that are having problems. And we can see here we have multiple interfaces that have very high utilization. And this interface health gives us visibility in specific interfaces on this switch for utilization and discards or errors. So we quickly and easily have pinpointed the culprit in our degraded application experience, and we've greatly improved our root cause analysis, which would have maybe taken hours or days inside of many tools. And in DX NetOps uh, gives you even more granularity into network congestion uh, by surfacing these BST metrics related to these interfaces. Here we see high buffer utilization on this interface, and we provide even more information on ingress or egress ports or buffers, user queues, priority groups, and more. 
And you know, there could be thousands of buffers set up in your switch environment, routing traffic based on priority, but we're only gonna show you what's currently being utilized. So we remove all that noise um, that could potentially prolong your triage times. Always surfacing just the relevant information to you, like roll-ups, five roll-ups are here of varying metrics. And we can dive into this unicast, multicast, shared buffer utilization. We see we have these three interfaces assigned to priority group seven, and all of them have high buffer utilization. So right away, we easily understand that the traffic you have mapped to this priority group seven is impacted by congestion. And we're gonna provide uh, trend information as well. So we can see here, most of these, met these interfaces are using this unicast, multicast, shared buffer. And of course, we're pegged at 100%. Utilization is high. And this is a trend we can see over time as well. So all of this is extremely valuable information to your data center architects, your designers, when they have to constantly shape traffic. Um, and they continually need to understand and optimize how switch queues are being organized, buffers are being allocated, to always minimize a disruption to the application experience. So that was network congestion triage, real-time network congestion triage. Let's move into our real-time packet loss triage. All right, so I think we all know that packets can get dropped for various reasons, and Broadcom Silicon can directly send a copy of that drop packet along with the drop reason to DXNetOps or any third-party monitoring tool. So in this demo, we're gonna look at three different use cases where packet loss directly impacts the application experience and how we can drastically improve root cause analysis and your triage times. So here we see our DX NetOps fault management topology visualization, and we're gonna see a degradation on this sonic switch. And we instantly understand the infrastructure affected and with one click, we'll understand the root cause of the issue along with intelligent insights and the specific reason for the packet loss along with recommended re remediation to restore the application experience. So with a single click uh, to our unified NetOps portal across fault performance and flow, let's start troubleshooting these packet loss events. So a common packet loss scenario is an erroneous automation job for a deployment configuration which sets an invalid ID on a data center switch. So here we've identified a packet with a VLAN ID that doesn't exist. And so of course packets are gonna be dropped. So immediate notification of this with descriptive reasons and error codes are presented in our integrated alarm console, along with configuration comparisons for an easy rollback of changes. And we can also give network teams symptoms of the packet loss, the probable cause and re recommended actions to take to resolve the issue. Integrated topology visualization is also available for enhanced visibility, along with in-context interface health for granular visibility into utilization, trends, and even discards. This saves hours, if not days, of, our, of root cause analysis troubleshooting in multiple tool sets like packet sniffers or log analysis, always helping to preserve your SLOs, your SLAs, and the application experience. Another scenario is a security issue related to packet loss. So DX NetOps has detected that the source and IP address here are the same. Maybe this is someone trying to attack the network with spoof packets. We can quickly identify security reasons with real-time notification of these packet drops where source and destination are the same. You can use runbook automation to block that IP address and quickly resolve the packet drop scenario before the app, is ex uh, the app experience is impacted and customers are even aware there's an issue. Our third scenario, another packet loss use case is uh, bad routing issues on the network. So we all know routing issues can cause loops in the network resulting in packets hitting time to live limits and routing loops are a common issue. Uh, they're always very hard to identify, even with good topology visualization tools. So this common scenario always results in application outages, customer experience issues, or even unless unnecessary load on the network. But we can see that the Broadcom solution here provides immediate and valuable information in the alarm console like source and destination, protocol and port number, which helps immediately identify the application impact. So in addition to these three drop reasons we've demonstrated, Broadcom supports real-time visibility for many other types of packet drops, such as MTU mismatch or layer two, layer three header errors, parity errors, tunnel errors, and, and much more. 
All right, so let's move into our final demo on real-time AI ops for network latency triage, powered by our silicon and telemetry capabilities. All right, so AI ops from Broadcom, powered by our silicon and telemetry capabilities, gives you a simplified service view of your critical and non-critical applications. And it's based on many factors, but especially the user experience. So our service analytics engine here is easy intelligence into the health of all your critical services. And we have application-centric views of availability, but we can also sort on alarms and users and KPIs. So there's an availability issue here within our fabric we can see. So let's investigate that in context. Our service analytics summary pages gives operations teams easy and simplified SLA and SLO views with intelligent metrics like risk levels and availability and user counts. And alarm analytics are here with 193 raw alarms automatically reduced to two anomalies and two service alarms. And this is a significant alarm noise reduction going on here. Our topology visualization of the service enables quick triage of healthy infrastructure and their relationships and even the weight of how this degradation is, is impacting the overall service. So if we look at the first of our two service alarms, we see an unresponsive Ethernet 32 interface. So for more information, let's view the related alarms that were automatically correlated into the service alarm. So now we're looking at the root cause of this service impact automatically detected by our analytics engine, along with the associated alarms. And our AI ops engine, IntelliJ, understood that when Ethernet 32 went down because of failover rules in place, traffic has now breached thresholds on Ethernet 31 on the same switch. When we click on the Effective Metrics tab, it shows a machine learning algorithm used to identify the anomaly. And if we look at the anomaly detected here, this isn't your normal SNMP data. This is per packet data we're getting directly from silicon and telemetry. And the switch in the embedded silicon itself is telling us that there is congestion on this interface due to our unresponsive interface 32. We can compare metrics for even further validation. So we see not only do we have congestion on interface 31 on this switch, but resulting packet drops as well on the same interface. It's an easy comparison to see how abnormal network behavior is impacting our service degradation. So to realize the power of the silicon level access to network data, uh, we can dive deep into our AI ops for deep packet and flow analytics for even finer grain visibility. So right now we have a really powerful dashboard for operations teams, but because it, it allows easy access to understand the applications affected by network congestion. Instantly we see where the congestion is, related packet drops, and most importantly, Broadcom's in-band flow analyzer. We get flow information at packet level granularity to understand the application impact. So let's look at the flow within this queue. You can set application level performance targets such as max end-to-end -end fabric latency with granular drill downs to application level or flow level down to packet level. Our topology level dashboard here shows packet path tracing and shows us the path that this specific flow took over our switch fabric, as well as the culprit switch that we're diagnosing here. Per hop latency is where we can see the latency of this flow 108 as it traverses the network. As it moves from switch to switch, we can easily see that spending more time on our dot .228 switch. Each one of these bars is a per packet view of flow 108 in nanoseconds. It's the most granular visibility in the network uh, for network performance today in the industry. And because we timestamp each packet as it crosses silicon, each bar here shows the time it's spent at each hop. And this is gold to network engineers and architects. It helps them immediately pinpoint congestion affecting app experience, along with proactive SLO monitoring. So the Broadcom solution detects problems before it happens, slow degradation, even small failures are caught early before they cascade into large revenue impacting outages. Even further visibility, our AI op solution enables layer two topology visual visualizations of your leaf and spine architectures, as well as the direction of flow and traffic depending on where it's going over the network. So let's go back to our presentation real quick after our demonstrations here. 
Okay, so I think as we saw and I demonstrated today, AI Ops from Broadcom, along with our industry-leading network monitoring solutions, enables real-time visibility into network congestion, network latency, packet loss events, uh, even with exact reasons and other key packet details. So leveraging this one-of-a-kind integration, uh, operations teams are able to quickly correlate network performance issues to the app experience, service impacts, uh, this all leads to faster root cause analysis, as I think we really demonstrated today. And it's driven by our Broadview Plus telemetry, and it's directly exported by Broadcom Silicon. And as a result, Broadcom solutions deliver the highest scale with best in-class TCO. So I want to thank you today uh, for attending this proof of concept from Broadcom. And look for our Broadcom Academy on... SD-WAN monitoring and visibility uh, for day two at Onug Fall 2020. And again, have a wonderful rest of your day and see you tomorrow at day two. Thank you.